Hey, how you doing today? I'm Lee, and I thought I might share something with you that's a tad bit personal, but I was thinking, is it really? Um, it's something that a ton of people struggle with. I think more so when we get older. The older we get, the harder it is we have trouble sleeping every once in a while. And uh, once upon a time, something happened, a real bad thing happened to me. And hopefully it won't happen again until I take my last breath. But uh, well over 10 years ago, I, I have to uh, get my calculator out. I'm getting so old, I guess. But uh, well, I guess it was 2004. I went uh, about three, four months without sleep. And that wasn't fun. It was not fun at all. I, you know, really had some uh, some funky, bad clinical depression and anxiety going on, and uh, probably should have been hospitalized for that. But um, anyway, I survived, and I'm much better now. I still struggle with some uh, nagging insomnia once in a while, but Lord have mercy, it wasn't. Hopefully, I'll never have it as bad as that was again. You know, and it was three years before I found somebody else with a similar story, so I really thought I was crazy there for a few years, but, um, you know, just, uh, wanted to share that because I know I reached out to a guy recently in California on YouTube, and, uh, he seemed to be very encouraged when he found out how bad a shape I was in, and I was able to recover from it, and, uh, so you know, there's a lot of common sense stuff you hear all the time, diet and exercise, uh, and uh, you know, I don't know what in the world I would have done in the past since starting that year or the year after, uh, I started using Tylenol PM whenever, you know, as needed, and uh, I still, that stuff's still a lifesaver for me sometimes. Um, I would also recommend melatonin and uh, uh, so whatever works for you but anyway uh, I've told people that before I don't tell just anybody I guess I am now but uh, a lot of several people don't believe me because you know I, yeah it's crazy it, uh, but unfortunately a lot of people unfortunately go through that and uh, uh, obviously after probably even just a few nights without sleep or especially a few weeks or a few months <laughs> you're gonna have a suicidal thought or two or three or three hundred but uh, mercy just hang in there if you've got it as bad as I had at that time just hang in there keep trying don't give up um, you don't have to uh, uh, you know do anything really bad but what a gorgeous day today and uh, there's my cat over there hanging out, so I might go pet her or scare her away with my dirt bike. Anyway, hang in there if you're if you got that uh, real bad insomnia, anxiety, whatever, mental illness, emotional. You know, if you can get your sleep under control, you'll feel much better. So, sweet dreams. Take care, and word to your mother. <laughs>